Hey, in genetics, there are few terms which confuses us, like what is DNA, chromosomes, gene locus, homozygous versus heterozygous, genome, genes, and alleles. So in this video, I'll cover the basic terms. Make sure you watch the video till the end. So let's begin. A genome is like a book of information about genes or more properly we can say a genome is an organism's complete set of DNA including all of its genes. All living organisms are made up of cells and cell structure and function is regulated by the nucleus. Now the nucleus contains the genetic information in the form of chromosomes. And these chromosomes, or we can say each of the chromosomes is a single long molecule of DNA which is coiled and tightly packed. D-ribooxynucleic acid carries genetic information and if we stretch and unwound it, it looks like a double helix. If you want to know more about it, you can just go and watch our video on DNA helix. The small section of the DNA that codes for a particular trait or character are the genes. Some genes act as a instructions to make molecules called proteins and some proteins form complexes to perform a cellular function. Now these chromosomes are not visible in the cell's nucleus, not even under a microscope. Each chromosome has a construction point called the centromere which divides the chromosome into two sections or arcs. The chromosomes consist of two identical halves called chromatids. These chromatids are joined together at a point known as centromere, as we already said. It is also consisting of P arm, which is the short arm, and the Q arm, which is a long arm. Now, the next one that we will talk about is, which is very important about chromosomes, like we have a two sets of chromosomes, like one which is known as the haploid that consists of one set of chromosomes and we signify it as n the number of chromosomes and the diploid that has got two set of chromosomes in human n is equal to 23 whereas for the diploid it consists of 46 chromosomes Gametes are haploid, whereas somatic cells, also the body cells, are the diploid. The diploid, they are also known as the non-homologous chromosome, whereas they are the pair of homologous chromosomes, one from the maternal side and one from the paternal origin. Now, in a pair of homologous chromosome, one is inherited from the male parent and the other from the female parent. Also, we can see the parental or maternal homologous chromosome. An allele is a form of a gene that is located at the specific location. And the specific location or the position where it is located it is also known as the gene locus on a specific chromosome. At each gene locus, an individual has two alleles, one on each homologous chromosome. Alleles can differ from each other. Like in this case, we take uppercase B shows the heterozygous condition. So alleles can differ from each other like in case as we know that each parent has two alleles for a trait. They may be homozygous or the heterozygous. 
homozygous indicates they possess two identical alleles of a trait trait means character or in this case we can say that the loci with identical allele are the homozygous condition and the allele in one locus has chain which resembles the heterozygous condition for example locus of eye color gene these two trait with the upper case a a signifying brown and lower case a signifying the blue color and the locus is the color of the eye homozygous dominant genotype possesses two dominant allele of a trait homozygous recessive genotype possesses two recessive alleles of a trait and heterozygous genotype possesses one of each allele for a particular trait so like for an example if we take where upper case a or the capital a is dominant so the brown color is dominant here and the lower case a which is a blue resembles the blue color is recessive in this condition there could be a combination of a a with two upper case a forming the homozygous dominant with one upper case a and lower case a forming the heterozygous dominant and alleles with two lower case a forming the homozygous recessive i hope you understood the video you can also connect us to the other social media platform make sure you subscribe